All right, y'all. Welcome back to some more God of War. Oh my God, my face itch. Let's jump right back into it. After you, my friends. Say so. Nista. You say, why did I press square? <laughs> Where are we going? The cleanest cabin in all the nine realms, and I'd prefer it to stay that way. Not looking at anyone in particular. Kratos. <clears throat> After that Thor incident, we thought we should make up some rooms. Till you can figure out your next moves. Nearly there. <laughs> Fucking century, bro. As you can see, we've settled here in the realm between realms. It's nothing much, but it's safe from Fimba Winter, safe from Odin's eyes. And you really can't beat the view if you're into shimmering gray voids. That's amazing, Sin. We have a plan to talk to you about, actually. Intriguing. Uh, I'll see something. <sighs> Rusty blades. So, okay. So obviously I can't use my shoes yet. Some stuff. I swear I thought about that. Come in handy. What was the little mushroom? The fuck? Come in. Come in. Now, if you would just wipe your feet very thoroughly, I'll wait. You're not gonna wipe your feet, are you? <laughs> okay then. Your bedrooms are there. The kitchen is just over there. Any? Anybody need a snack? Kratos? <laughs> snack? I do not need a snack. What we need. Is your help getting to Sparto Farm so we can try and rescue Tyr? To Tyr? Alive? I mean, that's... What? It's okay. I told him everything. Everything? You waited my son and disobeyed me. No, I, I kept an eye on him. <laughs> on your behalf. Nothing risky. Everything very safe. Somebody else speak. What's important right now is that we try and open up travel between realms again. You said you know a way? Yes, I do. I just, it's just, there's, it's just a lot of mud. And why haven't you opened the way already, man? Well, to be frank, there was something we needed your help with. Oh, the Holder brothers finally require the services of the smartest man alive. That's it precisely. Hey, not so fast. How'd that get in here? <laughs> What the hell is he anyway? That is my son. Well, what in all yarns me the happen to him? He's too damn tall now. <laughs> he looks like that. I blame you. I blame you. Well, come on then. Let's get him something that fits at least. He's just getting older, you dark prat. Didn't you ever have an awkward phase in your youth? Hey. I suppose what's done is done. But you'll be putting your foot down from now on if you know what's good. Oh, he's trying. Believe me. All right, let's gear you fuckers up before you go off gallivant. You're a tough hero that side. Mmm. Busted up good. <laughs> Wouldn't you rather I just whip you up a new one? It is important to me. Well, I'll see what I can do. In the meanwhile, how about I fix you up with something to get you by? I don't 
only got materials to make one of these in the here and now. You bring me more resources, we'll see what we can do. High risk, high reward, parries? Absorbing attacks and striking back. So, oh, so attacks build up and you can strike back with the, fuck that, get my berries. <laughs> I, I know how to bury, that's all I need, I just need to bury, bro, that's all I need, bro, it's all now, fuck all that. If the kid's gonna insist on getting taller, best make a habit of swinging in for new duds. Nice. Aquarius got some drip now. Aquarius, Atreus. My dumb ass, I can't even talk. I bet. Hmm. Looks like Fimble Winner's been hard on her. Give her here. She's overdue for some Brock love. Uh, <laughs> Brock love. Nice. I need a chaos flame. Found some items you left behind. Tossed them in the chest. What would you do without? I'm gonna go look around. Check out my room. Tell Sindri when you're ready. Nice. I'm gonna look around too, the fuck? Wait! Those stairs will not support you. Please don't break my house. Please don't break my house. Done to airborne enemies. Especially if it's giving me more luck. Keep my strength up. Really, just gonna be prioritizing strength and stuff. And how's life been treating everyone's favorite as your Vulgarian? The fuck you call me? <laughs> <laughs> Exquisite. Cool with the stuff I got now. Why did I press that? Hey, come see. I guess this is where they store the food. Nice to have options if I wake up hungry. <laughs> we'll be eating all the damn food. Finding everything all right, I hope. Let's get down to business. How do we unlock the realms? We'll just need something from back at the workshop. Follow me, and be sure to bring the head. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, where exactly is Tyr being held? He is imprisoned in a mine somewhere. That's all we know so far. Hmm. The realm is full of mines, you realize. You'll need help narrowing it down. Ooh, you should talk to Durlin. Who's Durlin? He's a cousin of ours, sort of. Works for the city on safety issues. Should have access to all kinds of information on mines. And I know he's no friend of Odin. That's why your mother sought his help when she was trying to whip up a rebellion. Ready? A rebellion? Did you know about that? 
I did not. A rebel leader who knew more. Sounds like exactly what we need. I think you missed the ta-da. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. I'll have this oiled up in no time. Meet you at the gateway outside. Rebel leader? Derlin? <laughs> if that ain't giving a hound a haircut. Huh? And you, you just remember things however they pop into your being, don't you? <laughs> I suppose you think Derlin's just counting the days until a couple of strays show up looking for trouble. What do you mean, Brock? Will he help us or not? No, oh, never mind. It ain't old Brock's place to catch Betray us. All right. See you out there, Sindri. You hear that? <clears throat> I don't know what the little mushroom dude was. Are those some kind of dragons? They're so far, I can't tell how big they are. The hell? Let's hit it. What are you doing? I don't think they're a threat. Also, aren't you way out of range? Oh, oh, oh man. We'll just need the Bifrost and the head. Brock, do the touching. Oh, this would be the part requiring my assistance, then. You said it. This device here has been crafted to your measurements. It'll help you get a better look at the problem with those Bifrost eyes of yours. So, uh, do I control this thing somehow, then? Oh, no, 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 no. This is just to hold you in place while we shine this light in your eyes. Oh, oh, Cindy, a sodding bastard! <laughs> Open. Open now. I was really hoping not to use the eyelid clamps. Do it. <laughs> oh, that's it. Torture that's it. that man. Good. Now, release. Still on poison. Oh, that's our cue. Come on, hurry. I'm coming, I'm coming. Crosswalk of eggs, man. What was that for? You'll see soon enough. Just there. That should do it. See? No permanent damage. I'll show you permanent damage, you wee fuck. Get us. <laughs> throw me at him. Horns first. <laughs> Can't you take a joke, you old goat? <laughs> <laughs> they bullying this man. The Bifrost is broken. Now that we've reconfigured these gateways to use Yggdrasil seeds, you won't need a travel table or a Bifrost lamp anymore. I also used it for light. Okay, good note. I'll figure something out, but first... Come on, let me show you how it works. Okay, aim your key at the rune for Svartalfheim on the right. Then concentrate. Nice. This is gonna be our fast travel here. Let's go. This should take you to the wetlands outside Nidavellir City. I'm a Just wetland. make your way to the town square and ask for Durlin at the tavern. You sure they'll know him at the tavern? Durlin's always been an but inveterate inebriate. I suppose he might have completely changed, but in my experience, eh. Did you want to come with us? Oh, I might drop in, but the wetlands are moist. And the grim are everywhere. <laughs> Hostile, slimy, foul-smelling creatures. But good luck! Thanks. Wait, what? I said good luck! Oh. Whoa. Do you feel that? What's that like? Anything. Everything. It's warm. We can probably use this boat. If I can just get it free. You say so, kid. Careful, lad. Why are these things so fast? 
to a lively start. Petraeus, you dropped your guard. I got the boat free, though. If you say so. I still can't believe Mom led a whole rebellion here against Odin and never talked about it. The fact that it didn't go well oh. might have come that notion. What your mother did before we met was her business. Did you ever ask? <laughs> Eyes on the water. There are resources. Is he? If you never asked mom about what she used to do, what did you talk about when you met? Like, did you just say, woman, guard the house? I will go to catch fish in the river. And then leave for five days? No. Your mother was far better at fishing than I. <laughs> Woman got the house. Oh fuck. Did you see that over there? See what? I definitely didn't. What the fuck? But I see this. I to get that. Appreciate you. That wheel is blocking the channel. I imagine if you can turn it, we should be able to get through. These are wetlands, huh? Pretty accurate. It is a bog. The smell is making my eyes burn. You know what is a fair bit more potent than when I last visited, now that you mention it. <laughs> <laughs> it is a bog. Looks like the path continues on the other side of that geyser. Uh... <laughs> if only we were in Midgard. That water would be frozen in a second. Mother, do you think freezing it would work? Had the right idea. All <laughs> <laughs> oh, these fucking things. Oh, no. The other one. I don't think it's around here. It's probably somewhere else. Tyr was a friend to the giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. If he was a part of the rebellion here. It's certainly possible. The god of war often advocated for the giants. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. Come on. There's got to be a faster way to get down there. I'm looking for that other fucking thing. Oh, what the fuck is that? Gremlins! Oh, nasty hit! You alright, bro? Oh, my fucking goodness. Beat by ass. 
Now. to be tweaking bro is it heavy attack I don't remember it being heavy attack it might be who knows let's try oh, okay that one disappeared oh my fucking hell Angry. Okay. Another thing that's tripping me up too. He's playing Elden Ring. I <laughs> did try to play this like. Up top. Gotta be some way to turn the wheel up here. Well, there. Give a man some warning if he's about to suddenly end up snout deep in cheek. The ground. Was that an earthquake? Hmm. An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Svartalfheim. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Think you can reach the wheel from here? Oh wow, nice job getting it to lower exactly where we need it.
I was thinking, because it's so warm, maybe it's not that the cold hasn't made it here yet, but maybe it's just different in Svartalfarm? Aye, lad. Fimble Winter doesn't strike all realms quite the same way. Weird that Fimble Winter doesn't always make it winter. In Midgard it does, but as you can see, the effects here appear far more gaseous in nature. Observe the geysers. Observe the aforementioned aroma. These effects were present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to them. True. I wonder if it's gonna be like Valkyrie type enemies too. Like Valkyrie mini bosses or something like that. Father, up there. Can I not jump over there? I honestly thought I could jump on that. <laughs> I guess not. Wait a minute. Give me that. Is there slag deposits? The boy dead. Cap those geysers. Hmm. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't work. Oh! Oh, like, uh, ain't no way. Guys, 
there another one somewhere? So what the fuck am I supposed to do with that? Jump across or something? What the fuck? Can I pull it? Can we cross now or what the fuck? No back up. Captain. Am I supposed to like time it right or something? Hey, did that geyser up there just get stronger? When you froze the geyser, the pressure must have changed for the ones around it. So maybe there's a vantage point. We can get a better look. <laughs> Really? So is there another one? Or oh, I can't do this one. That's what I'm trying to do. Yes, the wheels moving and the gate coming down. That's more of an ingenuity for you. Back to the boat. If the dwarves of this realm are anything like Rock and Sindri, it's hard to imagine them siding with Odin. Well. All too often, people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offered them safety, and defying him can be quite dangerous. Maybe they just need a couple of gods to come along and take the fight to him. Atreus, that is not why we are here. I was only joking. War is not a joke, especially where gods are concerned. Let me get that. The fuck? Oh, maybe. No, I'm gonna have to go through some bullshit to get it. Thirty-three. Oh, another Yikes. Time. I just realized this place I never is the other one. And yes, I am staying alert. There are probably tons of those grim around. There are. Is there right here? Hi guys! Chop that motherfucker. Uh, 
missile. Set off on me. That's the shit up. I'll hold the apple. Open the gold in the chest. Give me something good. As an ally for war. I just... I'm trying to keep our options open. Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here, exploring a new realm. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warmth? Maybe. Looks like we gotta find a way to open that gate if we want to get to Nether Valir. No, no. Then 
How shall we catch it? Flank it. Attack from behind. Good. Mista! Gotta get behind it. But how? Fuck, let's see what it dropped. Damn, dropped a bunch of shit. Appreciate it. Father, uh, up there. Go! I need that. Halfway there. There's gotta be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. I get it. If you freeze the geyser, the pressure will turn the wheel. Is that how we do it? Oh. Oh. The block's coming down. We can pull up there. Try hitting the rope holding the block. Maybe you could try hitting the rope holding the block. <laughs> nice one. That's one of Cavassier's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. I'm not just that like hello. Lad, if I may, what exactly are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well. Like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and... 
maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? Let's hope Tyr's in a talkative mood after being imprisoned for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no <laughs> proof Tyr is truly here. Right. That earthquake earlier. Do you think there will be another one? It's unlikely, but geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fimble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye. You might be onto something, lad. Atreus, look ahead. Wow. Now this looks like a city. Welcome to neither of the brothers. Hey, dwarves! Oh. They're, uh, running away. Uh -oh. An alarm. I'd only sound an alarm like that if I still had my body and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. Why all that for us, though? They are scared. Most definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. Hey, could we talk we to you for any trouble, please? There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own, and hope they let us in. I hope they let us in too. The buildings here really are incredible. The, the detail in the woodwork is quite extraordinary. <laughs> is that a statue of Odin? They must really love him here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No! One less feathery spy. It's only 48 this time. Wasn't it? I think it was like 112 or some shit. I know it was over 100. Sindri. Or is that just heat? Hello. I'd return your surprise, but I did know you'd be here. I've got something for you. Thank you. Me scraps. We're probably gonna have to go up there anyway. Oh shit. What is a dwarf? You know, I'm glad I came back here at least once before Ragnarok. Stones could talk. Then they'd have mouths. <laughs> Filthy, disgusting mouths. Do you mind if I fiddle with your bow? Well, you are long overdue for a replacement. <sighs> Taking advantage of certain material. Ow! Structural sensitivity <laughs> to sonic vibrations has been something uh, I've been meaning to try for quite some time now. Thanks for uh, finally trying it. What's it gonna be this time? Patience. I find it's best to see these things oh, in action. Uh. Take aim at that gate there, but before you loose, say, Skialfa. Skialfa. <laughs> Skialfa. Ah! 
Well, I certainly didn't expect you to disturb half the creepy crawlies in need of the lair. How was I supposed to know they were there? <laughs> behind you! Look out! Fucking little shit! Behind you! Look out! Okay, so, Derlin. Sindri, any idea where the tavern is? Do I look like I've ever been to a filthy tavern? Oh, I forgot about the resurrection. The sewer you just punched a hole through seems promising, though. For you. It should lead to the other side of the city. It's not like you're able to open other doors around here. So this lockdown really is because of us? Oh my, yes. Odin's grip on this realm is so firm, any outsider is considered a threat. Sounds like an Odinism if I ever had one. Another of Cavassia's poems. I guess we're off. Damn tavern. Yeah, I think I can. Best of luck. Any outsider is considered a threat. Is that to protect the dwarves? It sounds like it. But knowing Odin, there's sure to be an ulterior motive. Well, <laughs> oh, everyone's hiding on this side. God, I apologize. I've been up since like 6 a.m. But of course, as always, guys, I'm going to have to stop here. I'm running out of time. But again, like I said, as always, thank you guys for all the love and support. I'll see you guys in the next one.